What do you mean? Like, um, those, um, misc path, um, packages in the set section. Sec, uh, um, the only thing I would say that would be if you were to buy something. It would be a pet. Yeah, it would I, be a pet. I only, I only had 325 astros. But if you're thinking about, um, He's talking about actual, trading water sets. Yeah, if you're thinking about that, I'd get the physical one, the champion thing. Because oh, it gives you, it gives you the pet charger, warp crystal, shrapnel, the god books, item drop rate, and all that stuff. And you Wait, get prime. what? <laughs> the champions catch in the set section, in the misc section. You'd want that. You don't want the mages one because that's for uh, mages. <sighs> And the uh, the the main holy waters don't sell as well either. <clears throat> they don't. If you wanted to sell them. Oh, you, what do you want to do with it? Do you want to earn money? Because if you want to earn money, just buy sun pieces and sell them. Yeah, they are like the big hot ticket right now. You Let's can sell them what, for one point five mil each, and people will like get them off you right away. Actually, can, people. We'll even buy a for channel mic if you want to announce it, and you'll have a few million in a few minutes. So let's People see. will buy them for two mil, actually. No, I don't think so. So let's see. Uh -huh. Do I do I want EXP? Do I want money, or do I want a pet? Well, um, if you wanted the the primes and stuff, like how much are primes at the moment? They're still like five mil, aren't they? Yeah, 5.5. .5. Wow. So, you'd still be making more money buying the champion's cash and selling the, the primes. Yeah. yeah, that's true. Than even selling the uh, the sun boxes. Well, I have to keep some primes to myself. No, I'm what well, that's what I'm saying. Um, if you uh, if you sold if you sold the sun boxes, you'd be putting yourself out of pocket rather than buying the champion's cash and actually selling the holy water out of that. And whatever. <laughs> the holy waters can help you if you just had to use them. Especially right. that accuracy one, because if you're fighting monsters that are a higher level, then your accuracy will matter. Well, what I mean is, um, if you sold, if you bought, like, Ten sun pieces, mm -hmm. or whatever they're called, yeah. with three hundred astros. That's you're gonna you're only gonna get about ten. If you sell ten of them at two mil each, that's like twenty mil. Right. If you sold four primes at five mil each, that's twenty mil already there, and then you've got the holy waters as well. So what I'm basically saying is. The um, the buying the holy water packages is uh brings more money to it. It's it's more it's more value, basically. Right. It's a, it's the better deal. Is it is there a holy wire that most people buy or? How much do the uh, the damage holy waters go for? It's like nine mil. I remember. <clears throat> I saw them for 4.5, um, lightly. Oh. Uh, yeah, there you go. There's oh. a physical critical, critical damage holy water. Yeah, you can sell the crit physical critical and the physical damage for the same price, and that'll be about around 5 mil each. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but how much is that stuff? Two hundred and fifty-four astros. You get two of each holy water for that, don't you? No, you get four. Oh. You get six primes, and you get ninety-nine purchase god title books, a warp crystal shrapnel, and a pet charger in case you buy a pet. I don't yeah, see how that makes sense. It's nice. <laughs> yeah, but <clears throat> are you sure you wouldn't gain more? Of selling sunboxes because yeah. the sunboxes are like um, 
Uh, wait. If you Hold buy on. hundred, uh, if you buy forty of them, they are one hundred. Uh, Astros, and you can gain pretty much sixty mil with that. And yeah, yeah you'll earn more off of pieces. Hmm. You'll earn more off of pieces by money wise, but you'll be just spending out of your pocket though. Well, what? You have anything? Um, oh, I think I calculated it wrong. <laughs> it depends on what you want, really. I mean, with um, like, uh, XP nostrums and stuff, I can supply you advanced ones, um, because I still have tons of those. And that's all we're gonna need until we hit like level hundred, maybe. And if we wanted to, we could get um. Enhanced ones, but those will really make you level faster. How anyway. much? How much XP does the nostrums give out? Well, the ones. Hang on. Where are you actually? I'm. Right. I'm in the. Right here. Okay. I was in the fashion shop right now. Okay. Hang on a sec. Um. Well, if the selling sun pieces gives you more, then you could probably just sell the sun pieces and then buy whatever you needed. Yeah, true. Yeah. And it's, only, if you it's only 100 Astro if I want to buy 40 of them. And if you wanted to try your luck, if you get lucky and get a factory coupon, then you're set. <laughs> get what? Coupon? And a factory coupon. Okay, those things yeah. are like almost 200 mil, so. God damn. I think <laughs> the, um, the title coupons are still worth more. The Ignite title yet yeah, still worth a lot, but I don't, does it drop? It's uh, it hasn't dropped much lately. No, it's not as, not as far as I've seen. Well then, yeah. But if you get that, then you you're set too. <laughs> More set than the other one. Yeah. I'll give you that for now. Um, as yeah. has the nostrums that give one hundred percent for three hours, you can use them until level um. Eighty. 80, exactly. Uh, those are very useful. And um, we should check because I think um, at least uh, as and Joey will have uh, one day iris stones with, with give, um, which give 50% um, 40. 40? Yep, 40. 40% uh, 40 XP as well. And yeah, we should be set at least until level 80. Yeah, that'll, that'll probably work. And uh, I guess that's when you start worrying about spending Astros, really, because at the moment it's like useless. You don't really need it to advance in this game. It's it's gotten so easy. Yeah. True. Yeah. True. All right then. <laughs> you can store that stuff in the fashion shop, by the way, so it doesn't take space in your inventory. Right. Hey, uh, what set could I use to give me HP and I could use the, uh, Ringmaster set? Because I don't see any... Because I don't want to wear the headpiece and get the, uh, XP bonus, because, I mean, you have the whole set. I want to at least look a little different. <laughs> I'm not can't. wearing the whole set. You can't wear a full set and the Ringmaster set at the same time. There isn't any full set which will mix with the Ringmaster. Oh, crap. Well, I mean, all three pieces gives you experience. You only need three, you don't need the full set. Yeah, no, I'm not wearing the full set either. I know. <laughs> I was well, saying you get the XP without wearing it, and that's why I'm trying to find a way to get that. Oh, you, well, then you you can wear the, uh, the Ringmaster set, and you can wear the Doodad set, or anything. Ugh. Boy, that's pretty scary. <laughs> <laughs> that is messed up. You can wear that makes it even worse. <laughs> you can wear any of the sets with the uh, ring set. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't think it's what she did. <laughs> I'm confused. Uh, Are you in game? Oh no. god. That was so weird. <laughs> 
And the Ooh. fact that you're smacking me around with the toolbox makes it even better. <laughs> <laughs> I, I thought so. <laughs> What's funny is is the guy that that's for never wears that thing. You're welcome. <laughs> the what? The the Tengu. Oh, the, oh, the Tengu was never the even wears that mask. Never. I don't know why it's named the Tengu mask. Um, probably the same reason area called the uh, the Cyber Wings, the Zo Wings, the Zo Cloak. Well, I like issue Oh, well, you missed it, as Zoe said. That was cute. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, um, Aubrey has the the Zo veil. What? She, she got it in Make a Make a Wish event. Oh wow. Aubrey has a lot of stuff. They gave it her even though um, it's not released in this version. They gave her... I think the GMs, like, have, like, certain popular kids' favorites and such. Yeah, they do. Yeah. It's kind of sad, really. (laughs) Because Ryu got his uh, beta hat that no one ever got. Just a different one. Not the one you get when you did it, but they gave you the other one, and he got the feather hat looking one. Just because he asked for it. Hmm, I forgot to get... Yeah, I need to do that. But, I mean, during events and stuff as well, it always seems to be like um, certain people win. It's like, if there's a crowd of people in a Find the GM event, and they're all there at like the same time, then the GM will give it to a certain person that they like, the more yep. popular kids. And uh, they seem to, in the Make a Wish events as well, they give a certain <laughs> prizes to all the more popular people on the server. We shouldn't be talking about this while it's recording. <laughs> <laughs> hey, GMs, just want to let you know we love you guys. We just, we just don't like how you do things. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's, okay. saying, that's saying a lot. <laughs> it, it should, if not, then they're some really bad people. <laughs> you guys can't find my IGN anyway, so burr. Uh, you yeah. shouldn't listen to these conspiracy <laughs> theories. These are not serious. These are just joking around. Yeah, listen, just like how people talk bad about Obama. They, they don't care. Oh, <laughs> uh, wow. Yeah, did, we we certainly shouldn't mention any politics on here. <laughs> uh, yeah, that just sucks. Well, some... you said there was only one rule, and that that was no quest. Now you make more rules. Yeah, you guys need to make your mind up. Yeah, but these are like going without saying. Oh, cool! I gotta don't really uh, want to offend some people. Uh, was there an event that gave out darts? Uh, I don't know. No, I, I just remember. got a bunch of darts. Wow. I have like 10 darts for no reason. <coughs> well, lucky you. I'm cool. just going to check my other characters. I don't have, I remember, I don't have any like, darts. I seem to get a bunch of stuff that I. I remember checking my gift box and I had a bunch of stuff in there for like no reason. And I was like, why did they give me this? Yeah, they gave me a lot of stuff on this character that I didn't even get on my main character. Oh, yeah, we're set on the uh, XP nostrums. I've got, like, uh, I've got 25. Wow. <laughs> well, I just looked. <laughs> I was like, whoa. <laughs> the Iris Day coupons, I'll have to check in all, because I don't have them on this one. Hey, dragon mount. Yeah. Ugly dragon mount. Why do you have an oh, eye yeah. patch on? Oh, uh, that's the uh, shaggy set. Oh, okay. Oh, that's right. I can take advantage of that. No, I can't actually. Never mind. Oh, uh, you can't put the eye patch on, also. Yeah, I just can't make the set work with all the other set pieces. Uh, I was trying to get each buff, but I can't do it. <laughs> None for no. you. You can get the min damage, but I'd have to sacrifice the other one. Uh, What's that? What what other one? Oh no, yeah, yeah. I can do that. But that doesn't really work, so you can just use the earrings. The eye patch and earrings is min damage. 
Oh yeah, that's right, I could do the... <laughs> <laughs> do this. Yeah. No, that looked terrible. <laughs> Welcome to yeah, that was my errors. <laughs> what? <laughs> like a fashion disaster. Woo! I've seen worse. Yeah, I, <laughs> you probably have. <laughs> oh, I have mail. Stop running faster than me. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was me. You people and your speed hacks and stuff like that. You just ran by the mailman. I know, I I, I'm lagging a lot. I can speak good. That person just swung at us. Okay. Like, whatever. <laughs> I'll just shoot him in the head. Later when you get guns. Yeah. No, I'll shoot him in the head with an arrow. Oh, yes, I have those. I should know those. Um. Bleh. I'll figure out my... my outfit later. <laughs> if that's what you're worried the most about, the Nope. <laughs> I've gotten everything pretty much mapped out. According to Ultimappy, the person who's like always looking into the game files for everything, um, there's a bunch of stuff uh, in there in the latest update. Soul Bake Breaker preparation event items fully transplanted. Um, plus 10 Valkyrie weapon box. Decreased. Oh, wow. Item limit level one event skill guidebook. Rep type food coupons. Four to eight slot proxy shop opening license seven days. Baby elephant set gift card. Uh, monster what tower. What baby elephant? Yeah. What's that? This is stuff that... that's that's been put into the game files but hasn't been released. Nah, that's funny. Monster Tower Warp Capsule. Like, which yeah, appears so those should have been released with this update, actually. Yeah, it should have, actually. Which appears to to only exist for a month anyways. I guess they didn't intend to make it permanent. Wow. Ishitaru Cyber Set Coupon. What? I'll take that. Fire Breathe Poke Guidebook and Poke Guidebook. So, plus 10 Valkyrie weapon box sounds like um, you click on it and it gives you a random plus 10 Valkyrie. Oh, what? <laughs> um, decreased <laughs> item limit level sounds kind of like um, the the bonus that you get from... Perfect. Okay. It sounds kind of like the bonus that you get from uh, Dot Nuri 3. Where it lets you use anything one limit, one level above you, but it's a skill guidebook, so it probably stack with it as well. The four to eight slot proxy shop opening license is the thing that lets you leave your pet in your shop for you to sell stuff. Hmm. Um, Me. baby elephant set that sounds like a new um, fashion set. Ishitaru Cyber Set. Sounds like a new fashion set. Probably containing Cyber Wings. And there's also a lot of content missing, which is in a big list. It goes change gender, system, level down Enchanted Hammer, um, plus 50% increase in Enchant Success, probability level down. So it adds 50% increase for level down. Um, enchantment level down has been extended from 10 to 15 to the maximum level so you can put it down um, 
by 15 levels. Numerical honor points, darkness accessories necessary when replacing the re weapon item has been lowered. So it costs less honor points to get darkness accessories and weapons. And the special nail ticket has been changed to allow trading of silver. I don't know what that means. No idea. No clue. Um, enchantment level was up five levels. Down the existing level has been extended to ten. Item selection is now available for free. Uh, durability and chance special items obtained through monsters has been extended to two hundred and fifty. Huh. So that means, um. You can enchant uh, the instant sets to level 10, and the durability, when they drop, goes up to 250. Um, pet with additional abilities. Pet with abilities add me to replace two simultaneous pet abilities. So you can add another ability to a pet, basically, if it has an empty slot. Um, special items has been renewed. Oh, you can enchant like lower level items like uh, Tiger Sign up to level 12. Oh, all blue items. So all rare blue items could be can be enchanted up to level 12 right at the start. That's quite a lot of stuff we're missing. That's quite a mouthful. <laughs> yeah. I wonder if I, yep. I wonder if like at least most of them will be released um like next update or something. Possibly. That would be nice. Well, they skipped a the whole update when they both had this one. Hmm. And there's, there's still a lot of bugs that people have been saying that need to be fixed for like months, but they've just ignored. Hmm. Yeah, I was checking to see if I had some stuff on this character to toss over. And I have a few things we could use. Not everything, though. <laughs> Well, some things are just completely useless, but I have some things that are actually useful. Like, I could get some pots we could use to spam in case we get near death. Or if you just want to die, go ahead. I saw like, I saw it playing of um Star Grey potions to use. Well I have a uh, the um Kali large potions that give HP ninety percent and those last a while if you use them at low levels. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah, so if we need some I can toss us some. How many do you have? That's a redundant question. Uh, <laughs> I have an alt filled with them, so if we need them, we can just grab a few. I can give everybody like like half a stack because I'm pretty sure you won't run through a stack unless, since I'm going to be taking most of the damage, I can just uh, yeah, yeah. Good doubt you guys will be getting beat up too bad. <laughs> As long as you stay behind the knight, you should be fine. I hate those people that go, ah, oh, but they're attacking me, and I'm like, but stay behind, and you won't get hurt. 
Yeah. I mean, the first character I made when I first started playing this was um, a knight. Uh, and went and went to um Templar. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back. Mm. Thank you. But it, I. That was the one that um had the level ninety some as my max level, so that was my highest character that I got bored were of him. Were you uh sword or club? Um I think I switched here and there. But I was uh -huh. I was mostly on sword. Yeah, I don't club does a lot of damage, but I like sword for some reason. Sword sword's quicker. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. Club leaves you open, but it learns a really nice fifth to you. Yeah. I mean, you can't say that one does better than the other because they both give TDD, so it's not a big deal. I just remembered I cannot do expert collie on this maestro. I feel fail. <laughs> Well, our two maesters together can do pretty good in there. Mm-hmm. They can, like, not be touched, right? Well, well they can. Uh, if they get hit, they're dead, but, I mean, uh, they're pretty strong. Like, a maestro, a maestro can solo Kali, pretty much. If they can do it. If you use right, right? If you use them right, yeah. Yeah. Like, I mean, my main can solo Kali, but that's just because he's buffed out, but... I play more of my rune walker now because Maester is getting so boring. You only just have to hit one button and it's okay. Yep. You one see this? to attack, and then when you get in trouble you hit another button to stun, and then you hit the button again to attack. Oh, it's like, oh, it's yeah. okay, I won't do that. It doesn't require that much skill. Like, okay, it's it's nice if you need to farm and stuff. Like for Kali, I would never run on my Rune Walker because my Rune Walker is just too squishy because she has to be in the monster's face to attack them, while my Maester just stands there and pushes Ooh. them all over the place and they are stunned like kind of thing. Yeah. But like for boss farming and stuff, I prefer my Rune Walker. And make sure it's drool. You don't know. See their face. They're about to drool anyway. <laughs> anyway. But yeah, that's it. You just do this, and then you do that. And sometimes might even do this. That's about it. And pretty much spells out a maestro. I think my minstrel is level, what, 170? I don't remember. I stopped leveling it. Um, ask you one stuff for your mage. Stuff like what? Like equipment stuff. Oh. Uh, wait. I'll type in here since you guys are talking. Equips? What equips? Like I have a dagger for you if you wanted. Uh, sure. Yeah, I was going to say that when I found out you were a gunslinger, I have some that you could use. They're pretty nice. My friend had them when he quit, but I keep them because they're pretty nice. And they're awesome. Unless you've got some mapped out or something. Not really. Okay. What kind of guns are they? Uh, they're the uh, Gulliver guns. Oh, okay. With, uh, yeah. I think 30 max damage on them. Okay. I have to check again. I don't have them on this guy. Let me. Hold on. Let me see. 
Left him on my gunner. You'll love his name, it's pretty interesting. Nah. Um, I also sent you another bow for later on. That's a funny name. Yup. <laughs> Did you get the bow I sent you? No, I'm checking. I'm checking it right now. Oh, that's pretty nice. I forgot about that bow, actually. Wait, what? What level bows are you sending to? Um, I sent. And then Rogue Bow and and the dark you know? the Dark Moon Prisons one. Oh well, I have two of those. One for level sixty-five and one for level seventy-five. So if that one's level fifty-five or whatever, then it's it doesn't it, need yeah, to it's fifty-five. Up. Okay, then here, take these. That way, you don't need to waste resources. Oh, I can't trade with you right in a second. I might actually. I'll just mail it because it's much easier. That way, it doesn't clog your inventory. Wait a minute, I'm probably not. There. That way you don't have to, uh, use the, uh, ah, um, uh, I forgot. That way you don't have to upgrade that bow because why you don't need to waste resources. Mm hmm. Because each one of them will be good enough. Who's that typing? Me. Because <laughs> oh. I keep hearing somebody and I'm like, what is going on? It's definitely my, not me. My keyboard doesn't sound like that. I don't know if anyone can hear my keyboard. Well, uh, according to Rach, uh, whatever his name is, um, uh, masteries from other weapons affect each other. Okay. That's what I told you. I used to think, oh, especially about bow. But that doesn't make sense, because if you switch weapons, then they're grayed out. Uh, I said that <coughs> if they do, it's probably a bug. But I said a good it's way. It's a bug forever. I said a and good way. And it's actually a good bug for us. And sorry. <laughs> I said a good way to test it is if you've got the third dagger mastery, equip a bow or an X bow and try attacking with it to see if you get the green crit add on. Does that mean that dragoons are the same, or is that just explorer? Well, it'd probably be the. Uh, for everyone. And I know it doesn't work for Dragoons because I've already tested that theory. It doesn't work at all. But you said the fourth mastery doesn't do anything for Highlander. Yeah, it doesn't. But Highlander is a totally different class. You were talking about different weapons on the I'm same class. about my Dragoon. I've used my Dragoon and it doesn't change. Okay, does anyone else need uh, weak weapon coupons? Because if you do, tell me now, because now I'm on the character where I have this. I'll, I'll be right back. I'm going to calm my dog down. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep.